planking has several advantages since it is a great exercise for the abdominal and core. Use the plank in your daily routine to make sure your core remains steady and powerful. Discover the advantages of plank exercises, as well as numerous forms of plank exercises with instructions. Benefits There are several physical advantages to planking. The core must be strengthened as part of any exercise program. A healthy core both feels and looks good. But more critically, it supports the body's ability to maintain equilibrium and power throughout virtually all other activities. The foundation for all fluid and powerful athletic motions is core strength. A solid core helps ease joint strain and help you adopt better posture. The plank exercise can also serve as the foundation for a test of the stability and muscular strength of the core. The plank is more of an aerobic workout than a strength building activity, but because it works a variety of muscles, it may also increase your calorie burn. How to do a plank? Choose a posture that allows you to fully stretch your body. You may get the necessary cushioning to feel at ease getting down on all fours by using an exercise mat. As seen in the video, you may decide whether to hold a plank on your forearms or your palms. 1. Start off face down in a plank posture with your forearms and toes on the ground. Your forearms are pointing forward, and your elbows are precisely beneath your shoulders. You should be gazing at the ground with your head relaxed. 2. Draw your navel toward your spine by contracting your abdominal muscles. Your body should remain firm and straight from your ears to your toes, without drooping or bowing. The neutral spine posture is shown here. Check that your shoulders are relaxed and not rising toward your ears. Your heels should be higher than your feet's balls. 3. For 10 seconds, maintain this posture. Drop to the ground. 4. Work your way up to 30, 45, or 60 seconds over time. If you want to know more about modifications and variations planks please tell me in the comment.